Hello, this is Kate, and this is uh, game eight with the orange team in the competitive league that I played in. Uh, this footage is quite old now. Uh, this was the last game that we ended up getting to play before we had an eight month lockdown. Uh, so here we go. It was good to see I was staying square with a puck. Uh, I remember uh, she tried to ram her stick right under my glove to break it free, but luckily it stayed in there. And it's one nothing for us. I can't grab the rebounds. So it's at least good to see that I'm sending them off to the corner. Not sure why I hunch over like a granny every time I play the puck, but anyways, work on that eventually. <laughs> and that's the end of the first period. I had to just abandon my stick because it got stuck around my defenseman's ankle there. Slap shots are allowed in this league. Uh, people rarely take them, but uh, it's nice when I get a chance to face one from time to time. Just testing at a butterfly slide there. The ice was not all that cooperative this evening. It's nice I'm remembering to get down into the RVH when people are getting really close to the corners, stopping me from letting in bad wraparound goals or anything. I do enjoy a good breakaway. It was also really great of my defenseman to take away the pass there, so I, I could focus on the shot. And that's the end of the second period. Kind of flung my left pad out there at the end just in case it snuck under my glove. Thank you, dear post. And what you get to see there is an ugly attempt at a slide where I forgot to actually use my skate blade and I had to just abandon it. 
got lucky with that screen. I really don't know what's happening with my butterfly slides. I, I don't remember the game well enough, but man, that's ugly. <laughs> Bit of an old-fashioned save there, but it worked out, and so I'll take it. Would prefer to butterfly slide over with my arms in, but you know, in the moment it's kind of hard sometimes to make those split-second proper choices. This was so awful. I tried to put it behind the net, and it just like slid off the end of my stick. Oh, and I managed to twist my pad there. That's no good. I started to drift back my net there, but at least I moved back out to the top of the crease before the shot. Surprised I didn't dive out to grab that, but I must have thought in the moment that it was a bit too far out of my crease to get away with it. At least I uh, made a better attempt at passing that time than the last time I handled it. A little hop forward to keep myself on the right side of the goal line. I was a bit confused uh, just before this face-off because I noticed just a sea of black jerseys and I was like, whoa, wait, how many are there? And then I noticed they pulled their goalie, which was the first time I think I'd seen a team pull the goalie in, in either league that I play in. So it was uh, interesting. <laughs> Luckily, I figured it out before I complained to the ref. And here's one of my favorite saves of the entire year. Off the shaft of my stick in the dying seconds of a one nothing lead. Oh my goodness. I was so stressed out, but I was so happy to uh, pull it off and uh, get the shutout, help my team get a win in our last game. Uh, well, what turned out to be the last game of the season for us, so really nice. I was really happy with the way I played this game and had a lot of fun as always. That's it for now. See you next time.